sign that you feel as fine as you look beneath your parasol the world is all a smile that makes you feel brand new down to your toes it's so ingrained in our brain and body of what hello dolly was and always has been and so what we really wanted to do was actually do a whole new dolly um, it really felt like you know the show's almost 50 years old and at this point it just really wanted to be reinvented and actually rediscovered and we actually deconstructed the whole thing that way and actually ended up coming up with this i think this really cool idea of actually putting this whole show that comes alive and lives within this world of this train station and how everything comes out of it the other thing that we really wanted to do with the show is just give it a different sound. Um, God love Carol Channing, and you know she did it so many times, but she really isn't a singer. Uh, and you know, one of the things that Jim and I talked about is like, wouldn't it be great if we got a Dolly who could actually really belt this show in a way like you've never heard it? Um, and then we found Nancy Opal. <laughs> <laughs> Is, is a widow and she's a matchmaker and basically she's also kind of an operator because you know as she says in the play that she's lived hand to mouth for so many years so she's always trying to make you know another dollar somehow she she supposedly teaches dance she teaches you know mandolin she does financial planning I mean it's literally anything that you could think of she'll pull a card out of her reticule and say that she's an expert at it um, but mostly what she is is a matchmaker and you know part of her plan is to um, see what she can do with this older gentleman who she says she's setting up with someone else but perhaps she's got designs on him herself and um, in the show um, uh, I, I think that that she's if there was ever a word for a character and they use it a lot in 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 musicals or, or in comedies is irrepressible and she's one of those people you just can't you just can't stop her in terms of traditional musical theater it's it's one of the best I mean it's up there with with Gypsy and Oklahoma and you know you know just the just the ones that everybody should probably see if if you're you're going to sort of partake in American culture other than football, it it's nice, it's nice to see something like like Hello Dolly because it really is a classic. It makes you feel brand new down to your